So, what I got today. Okay, I'm going to tell you about the HTC 10, which probably, as everybody knows, came out 2016, and why this is still probably the best Android phone that now you could probably get at a really good price. Uh, this is a cracking phone. So, I'm using this at the moment because if uh, anybody saw my Indu Pro 2 uh, review, you will uh, have uh, seen a very nice phone. Somebody, uh, one of my friends, saw the video and he liked it and he offered this new HTC 10 for a swap. So I said, yeah, why not? Um, I wanted to look at it. I've, I've always liked HTC since I had the original HTC HD2 was the first HTC phone that I had. I had the original HTC One M7 and I had the M8 and I loved them all. Uh, the HD2 at the time was a Windows phone and you could install uh, various uh, ROMs of Android on it so it was, it was how I really got into Android and installing custom ROMs so I mean it was a bit of a learning curve but I managed it so what do you get with the HTC 10 in 2017 okay well you get a cracking looking phone okay it's, uh, the the design is similar to the other you know previous HTC's but as you will see I'm not sure if it's clear here and I'm sure everybody who's an HTC fan knows it's got these kind of chamfered uh, edges it has uh, H uh, USB-C the screen is uh, 5.2 and it's a quad HD screen it's very 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 nice the front camera 5 megapixel with optical image stabilization cool the rear camera is a 12 megapixel uh, ultra pixel with optical image stabilization and some kind of laser thing for uh, uh, for focusing I found it to be uh, excellent the videos I thought um, shooting some videos on it I thought it uh, was excellent as well um, it has a Qualcomm 820 uh, processor with 4 GB of RAM this one comes with 32 GB internal storage and you can install up to two uh, it says, let me just double check this because um, I was surprised up to two terabyte with a micro SDXC card two terabyte on a phone wow so I mean that's pretty cool um, so the uh, it has, what else does it have, fingerprint scanner uh, the it has a Corning Gorilla Glass and it's the standout standout by you know a, a country mile is the high res audio it has its own uh, DAC for hi-fi and also has its own uh, uh, amp for the uh, earphones so really for the audio files for the people who really really appreciate their music this could be the answer to all your entertainment uh, desires needs etc 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 the sound is absolutely brilliant now and come and kudos to HTC because come uh, package with it is a pair of uh, high-res um, uh, earphones which I don't have with me because the guy who sold me the or, or who swapped me the uh, phone uh, he's he's yet to give me some of the the, the you know the the rubber things that fit in the ear too small for me so I'm waiting to get new ones uh, because they keep falling out so to listen to it uh, you know I'm using my trusty uh, Jaybirds um, and the sound is excellent, but I know that with um, you know me holding the HTC earphones in place, the sound was phenomenal. So really, you know, this is still a worthy contender for a uh, phone of 2017. Yeah, I, I know HTC now have gone for 
uh, a slightly different look in that Ultra, I think it's called the Ultra U, something like that. It looks really nice, but this is the last of the, the kind of uh, HTC M7, M8, M9. This was the, I think the HTC... HTC 10 was named after a 10 year anniversary, something like that. So, you know, you could probably really get, get this a, a, a really good bargain check on eBay, Amazon. This is a superb phone. Make no uh, uh, bones about it. I love it. It's really, really good. It has Quick Charge uh, 3, which is uh, will charge, uh, I think, um, within half an hour, will charge the phone to 50%. It charges really quickly. Battery life is excellent. <clears throat> it's um, it's um, I, I get through a day no problem. Uh, it's uh, you know probably the best battery life that um, I've experienced. Now it comes with the um, Sense UI. I'm just using a different launcher at the moment just to check it. This is called Smart Launcher. The uh, let me see if I got some photos. Yeah, I've taken some photos yesterday of some stuff that I'm trying to to sell. So you, if uh, yeah, this is a Polaroid land camera that I'm selling. Uh, I mean the the photos are. I mean look at that. I'm zooming right away in here. I don't see any graininess at all. I mean the photos are pretty 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 decent. Uh, oh, you can see the dust right inside there. Uh, the fo the photos are, are are pretty cool, so I, I think it, people would be happy uh, with that. Yeah, this smart launcher looks okay. I'm not. Um, I'll probably just ch uh, check it out for a day or two. So I did and two two, um, and I did it uh, yesterday or the day before, and I was getting a hundred and was well, hundred twenty nine, nearly hundred and thirty thousand. But I did get hundred and thirty five thousand. So you know, and I've read where some reviews where people were getting up to 150,000 so I'm not sure how they got that but it's a fast phone it will be more than uh, you know it's powerful uh, for all uh, your uh, daily needs and this phone would, would still probably hold up a year or two from now as well because uh, really um, you know with the, the fact of a really good camera the storage amount and the, this high res uh, uh, audio, you could really make this uh, last uh, quite a long time. Whether I will or not, I'm not sure. Um, let's see what phones are coming soon. Who knows? But you know, I'm really enjoying using it at the moment. Um, what else do I want to say about it? Okay, um, really, I, I don't really want to talk too much about it. I only wanted to share it with you because. You know, people may have bypassed this. Uh, the fingerprint scanner is fine. Uh, you know, usual. It's it's uh, no problems at all. As I say, I really wanted to share it because uh, you know why. If you can get this uh, a lot cheaper than it came, what, what it originally came out, I think it came out in April 2016. So it's still less than a year old, but you could probably get this at a really good price, and I, I really do think it is uh, worth uh, considering. Um, spending your hard-earned money on the screen is really good I've been watching a lot of the BBC iPlayer and uh, I've been enjoying it uh, I really do th now look I like big screens don't get me wrong I like 6 inch screens I like 5.5 inch screens but I really believe that the sweet spot for uh, the kind of perfect one-handed screen is 5.2 I, really, I think this is, you know, really anything above that it just gets a bit more difficult uh, to handle. And I've got relatively big hands, um, but I really think that 5.2 is the sweet spot for a, uh, a one-handed screen. The screen on here is phenomenal, that quad uh, HD screen, so nobody's going to really uh, complain about it. Now. Uh, they, they did away with the, if you can remember on the M8, M9, M7, they had the boom sound like the front facing ones. Well no, they've got a, a different kind of um, thing going on here. You have a top speaker here and you have the uh, bottom speaker here at the bottom underneath, not front facing. And uh, the HTC say that this offers a, a really good sound. But look, <coughs> it's fine. I'm not saying is uh, you're going to be listening to all your music through it. If I can remember my uh, 
you know, HTC 7 or HTC, HTC M7 or the M8. Um, I, I, I think it's comparable, um, if maybe it's slightly less, uh, but it's still pretty decent. So, you know, if that's a thing for you, definitely. Now, this laser thing for the camera, uh, I think it's pretty good. Uh, you can really get into uh, the camera settings. Um, they have it's quite nice. This, if you can see this uh, smart launcher here, you can have this uh, shape in the front. Yeah, I like it. Looks nice. In the camera, uh, you can uh, get a lot of. Uh, there is a pro setting here. I can show you. Can you see? Will it show you? Mm -hmm. Got it. See it there. Pro setting. Um, and then that will give you uh, more control of ISO and uh, a white balance and stuff like that. So you can really get into it with your photos and, and uh, probably get a bit better photo than I that than I would ever get. Uh, so the body, um, this is charcoal grey. I think this colour is, and it's this uh, aluminium. And I mean, it's it feels nice in the hand. Uh, the material is excellent. I, I, uh, you know, it's got a nice amount of weight, but it's not too heavy. So, you know, uh, just feel that quality. And unfortunately for HTC, I'm not sure how well this phone sold, but you know, they just, uh, uh, you know, they're kind of fallen behind the likes of uh, obviously Apple, Samsung, LG, etc. But and it's a real shame because they've really kind of come out with a lot of really good phones. Uh, the M9, I think they could have done better with the M9. It's not that it was a bad phone, but really people were expecting a lot more from it. So I really do think they could have been uh, come, you know, a lot better. Uh, so yep, yeah, that is it. I, I just really wanted to to show you it. Um, you know, there's plenty of other uh, more in-depth uh, videos on YouTube that uh, will uh, give you the full rundown of this, but. I wanted to highlight that uh, for 2017 you could really get yourself a, a, a very very good bargain even a refurbished one uh, you you know I, I think people who are Android lovers and people who are music lovers uh, f uh, you know photography lovers video lovers you really um, would get a lot out of this uh, phone I really don't think anybody would be uh, disappointed uh, at all. So um, I'm hoping uh, um, soon to have a few other phones uh, for review. Um, I won't tell you what they are, but uh, yeah, let's, I'm hoping they'll be arriving at some point. Um, uh, I think one's definitely coming uh, uh, next week, hopefully by Thursday, something like that. So I'll probably review that after a few days of checking it out. So. As the usual, anybody want to ask me anything, um, just uh, post uh, below. I will do my best to answer it in a timely manner. Um, and hopefully uh, I will keep this for a while before selling it. But I'll be, I'll be honest with you, what has been catching my eye recently, and everybody should check it out, is the new Sony camera, the XZ Premium. It's not out yet. It's coming in... Uh, end of April with that 4K HDR screen with the chrome finish really uh, looking you know I'm a sucker for aesthetics it looks really nice and uh, I'm sure it'll be very very expensive but you know I'm fancying it so we'll see um, so yep that's it HTC 10 love your music buy it bye